As President Bashar al-Assad's regime regains more territory from weakened rebels six years into the Syrian war, opposition activists and residents say mass detentions and disappearances are increasing. Critics say it's a long-running pattern of abuse, ruthlessly suppressing any hints of dissent in areas that were out of its control for years. In a new report released on Tuesday, Amnesty International says the regime hanged as many as 13,000 prisoners since 2011 in one prison alone. At least once a week, authorities carried out midnight executions in Naya prison near Damascus, the report says. The report was based on dozens of interviews with former detainees, prison guards, judges and lawyers. There is a systematic process whereby once or twice per week during the course of five years between 2011 and 2015, 20 to 50 prisoners are called upon, taken from their cells, told that they are going to be transferred to another civilian detention center. But instead of that, they are transported to another building on the grounds of Sidnaya prison, huddled into an underground room, and then they are hanged. And they are only told that they will be, um, that they are sentenced to death a few minutes before the noose is actually tied around their neck. Last year, Amnesty estimated that an additional 17,000 people had died in regime prisons across Syria since the start of the uprising. The Syrian government has long denied allegations of the disappearance of thousands of people and did not immediately comment on the Amnesty report.